Yeah, so within our business, it's really important to look at uh, manufacturing digitalization because um, there's only so far you can go in reducing machining times and process times. Uh, and it's a lot of these periphery events before and after where we can show some greater gains and, and maintain a leading edge on cost effectiveness within businesses. Within the digitalization process, um, we've already introduced quite a few technologies and one of the, one of the leading things we would like at the moment is uh, with four or five hundred jobs going through a factory in the week across multiple processes, knowing exactly where each job is at any one time, uh, particularly if it's moving from one operation to the other. So if it's just finished one and about to start the other, is it still where it finished or is it about where it's, where it's just about to start? Uh, and a heat map showing where these parts are would be invaluable in saving a lot of time. Introducing uh, digital technologies in small SMEs uh, generally can be quite cost prohibitive and um, a lot of the, the things that we're talking about within the shoestring uh, projects generally are very low cost and it can give you a snippet or a flavour of what, what, what the art of the possible is. Um, a lot of um, larger digital uh, solutions are generally costly. In, for example, you know, a serious planning system is probably in excess of £50,000. Being involved in this digital uh, shoestring project is really beneficial in a number of ways. It's uh, one that we're really local, it's great being associated with some of the academics in and around Cambridge, but also, you know, if we can help be involved in these processes uh, and these processes can be rolled out to other businesses across the country, uh, you know, it means that a lot of people can actually win out of this project.